ask you a couple questions? Thank you. Wow, okay. Yellow, love it. I love it though, and it's so something that I love that, is it strapless? or um, No, it has straps. Oh, okay, so who did, who decided what you were going to wear? You? Did you have somebody? That's my cousin Donald. He's like, you better wear that yellow dress. I'm like, okay. I know, it's freezing out here, and I'm sure you are cold, because I'm bundled in a jacket. It's actually so. good. I've been in Chicago a lot lately, so this is like nothing. Okay, and what are you doing out in Chicago? I am working on a music project out there. Oh, what kind of music? Um, if what kind of project? <laughs> I'm recording. I'm working with the label out there, EMI, mm -hmm. um, Rosehip Records. So. And what kind of music would that be? It's kind of like a European pop kind of vibe, you know. Um, it's kind of a mix of uh, maybe Kylie Minogue with like some early Madonna. Oh, that's great. That yeah. sounds exciting. Now, when can we? Be too different for out here. <laughs> no, you know what? Difference been working. So I would say keep it, keep going with what you like and what you're passionate about. And when can we expect to hear anything from it? Um, June of 2000 of this year. Okay, good. Because things happen. The economy, you know. <laughs> no, everybody's feeling it these days. Um, what about acting wise? Anything on the f acting front? Um, I did just get a copy of Surfer Dude in the mail today, so I'm excited. Good. Um, that one came out there. What was that? Last year, this year, or something. But um, still waiting comes out next month. Did you ever see Waiting, the comedy with the restaurants, Ryan Reynolds, Anna Ferris? Oh, I do remember that. I don't think I, I saw it one. though. It oh. Next month. oh. I was a lot bigger then. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not exactly sure. Wait. Wait. Yeah. Explain that one to me a little bit. I'm like a double D in this movie. It's really funny. <laughs> Okay. Hooters. I'm not Hooters, but like it's like a restaurant like Hooters, but it's called Tata. So everyone has like back problems by the end of the movie. <laughs> and how exactly did they inflate you for the movie role? It was like a lot of padding. I probably could have floated on the Hudson River. And did you have any thoughts of, of okay, I could do this one day. I think I could get the because you know out here in LA. You know what? It was honestly, honestly, it was kind of like a pretty cool fantasy come true because I've always wanted to work at Hooters because I always thought Hooters girls are so hot. And uh, I have, we have the shorts, but ours are pink, and we wear pink cowboy boots, and we do the whole routine for the guy if it's his birthday, like the Dallas Cowboys cheerleader. It's, I mean, it was so fun. Well, I think if that's on the video, we're all going out and getting a copy because <laughs> you're gorgeous. Never, dude, I was topless. No. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is exclusive, exclusive information over here. I would go topless for Matthew McConaughey. Matthew McConaughey, come on. <laughs> well, thank you so much. <laughs>